Hi, my name is Emily Chase, and today I'm going to be giving you a speech about my experience when I went to Zambia, Africa on a mission trip. Um, Zambia is located um, near the middle, not quite at the bottom, not quite at the top, and it's landlocked. It's also right above Zimbabwe, and um, it's Zambia, and the capital is Lusaka, which is actually where I went. Um, I was there for two weeks in June of 2008. I went with an organization called Family Legacy Missions where they do, um, they organize mission trips specifically to Lusaka, Zambia. Um, and there we ran a day camp for um, thousands of kids who were affected by the AIDS virus. Um, and um, it was called Camp Life and it was a Christian camp. We taught them about God and also provided meals for them and um, it also allowed them to get sponsored by people. Um, some of the things that I experienced while I was there was the extreme poverty. It's one of the poorest nations in the world. and um, But no matter what, these people are thankful for whatever they get. They're willing to give what little they have away um, without second guessing it, um, which is way different than it is here because we just hoard all our stuff and we just want more and more and more and they just, they have nothing. like. They literally live in mud huts with, like, they're empty, there's completely nothing in there, and, um, they're thankful for what they have, and they, um, like I said, they're willing to give it all away. Also, um, while I was there, they, um, we taught the kids about God, and it was surprising how much they already knew. Um, also the education level there is way off from ours, like a third grader here. Um, well, eleven year old here would have a fifth grade education, but there they might still be in like on the first grade level, and um, so that was very interesting. Also, their size because of the malnutrition that they have, the kids, um, like a fifth grader who is pretty tall and pretty big, would would over there would actually look more like a six six year old, like a six year old from the states. So it's very different there, the cultures are very different, and um, it was a great experience. There's millions of other stories that I could tell you, um, but does anyone have any questions? No. Okay, well, thank you for listening to my speech. My name is Emily Chase. Thank you. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hello, my name is Emily Chase, and today I'm going to be talking to you about my trip to Zambia and some of the things that I experienced while I was over there. Um, first, I'm going to start off by telling you where Zambia is. It's located in the south, north, near the southern part of Africa, but not all the way at the bottom. And it's landlocked, which means that it's not touching any ocean. Um, it's right above Zimbabwe. And the capital of Zambia is Lusaka, and that's where I went on my trip. And I was there for two weeks in June of 2008. Um, what I did while I was over there is I went on a mission trip with a company called Family Life, Family Legacy Missions, and um, they do missions only in Lusaka, Zambia, and um, we did a camp for um, kids that are affected by AIDS, and um, there are thousands of kids there, um, and you each had a group of like 10 or 15 kids that you would um, minister to throughout the week. Um, some of the things that I experienced there were that um, even though it's a country that is stricken with poverty, one of the most um, poor countries in the world, um, these people have nothing. They literally live in mud huts. And um, um, even though they have nothing, they're willing to give anything to you. They have nothing at all, and they'll, whatever they have, little they have, they'll happily give it to you. And it's amazing to see that because here, it's not like that at all. We just want more and more and more, and they just take whatever they can get, and they're happy to have it. Um, so that's one of the things that I experienced while over. I was in Zambia. Um, does anyone have any questions? Yes? Where else would you like to go? Um, well, I liked Africa. I would like to go back to Africa anywhere, really. Anywhere else? Yes. Would you recommend for people to go to Zambia? Yes, absolutely. It was a great experience for anyone of any age. It was awesome. Anyone else? So you would go back to Zambia? Yes. Is that all the questions? Okay. Thank you for listening to my speech. My name is